What is up, guys? It is time for another episode of Sly Customs. This will be a fleet maintenance. Yeah, I guess this will be fleet maintenance. We've got a new trailer. Brand spanking new 2018 model. Pretty freaking excited about it. Yes. I don't. You guys have probably seen the trailers we usually use creeping around in the background. <laughs> this is a definite upgrade. But uh, there are a few things we, we got. Andrew got a great deal on it. Yeah. And there are a couple things that you can tell maybe why we got a great deal on it. <laughs> and we're gonna correct them and make it better all around. Yes, sir. So if you are down with trailer stuff, truck stuff, stay tuned. So as we said, we got a new trailer and we've already got it as on the lift as we can get it <laughs> because it is much too wide to go between the posts and actually lift up so it looks sketchy yeah but it's really not too bad when I say not too bad it's not bad no this jack isn't doing anything the lift posts are under there but yeah we've uh Got the rear end on the lift, and we've got the front end on jack stands on top of things. But give her a shake. I trust I trust my life with it. Hell yeah. That's all this could be. So yeah, we're gonna do some things to the undercarriage. Oh yeah, you wanna show them the priority number one? So yeah, priority number one, as Caleb says. Or perhaps Ooh. one reason we got a really good deal on it yeah. is because the underside is not painted or anything. It's just raw metal. So we are gonna rectify that situation right now. Right now. With some Ace brand heavy duty rubberized undercoating. That's not Ace brand, that's Bondo brand. Oh, Bondo brand, you're right. That's why you paid Primo for that. <laughs> so we're gonna get to doing that. And then we've got some other stuff in store Later on, we'll leave you hanging for that for a second because I'm kind of excited about it. That was fun. Wow, Lee. That was a lot of, uh. Ha! Look at that. <laughs> Left my mark. Hopefully, that, uh, the underside of the trailer is as well protected as that spot in the floor. I'm sure it's much happier than it would have been. Yeah, well, yeah, no <laughs> doubt there. On to this pride and joy. Yeah, what, uh, what do we got here? We've got this sweet Badlands ZXR 9,000 pound truck slash SUV winch from Harbor McFreight Town. Heck where, yeah. Who knows where the town came from? Har Harbor McFreight Town. But there she is. Yep, we've got this Harbor Freight winch, and uh, we're pretty stoked to throw it on the trailer. We've never had a trailer with a winch on it. Fixing the mount it right on front and pull whatever we need up on there. Yeah, we're trying to make this thing as uh, capable as we can. This is hopefully going to be the Sly Customs Forever trailer. Maybe we'll put a banner on it or something. Ooh, that'd be cool. <laughs> I like that idea. Let's do it. <laughs>
Okay, another day. It is the next day, and uh, we found a thing. Yeah. This thing. She's a beaut. She's for a truck bed, but now she's for a trailer tongue. So we're gonna drill holes in it, put the battery for the winch in it, protect things, tow strap storage, tool storage, you name it. Fully functioning. The arms even hold it up. This is a Craigslist steel. Nope, Facebook Marketplace. Facebook Marketplace. We're pretty stoked on it, and uh, we think that's gonna be the next big upgrade for our, hopefully the Sly Customs Forever trailer. With a banner. With a banner at some point. I keep saying the banner. We have to do a banner. We'll find it. We'll make a banner. <laughs> Another fantastic day. We, uh, you guys got introduced to the new uh, Slide Customs Edition trailer. Yes, hopefully the 
last trailer we're ever really need rather than all the various you've probably seen piles of lesser trailers in the background <laughs> piles of lesser trailers <laughs> um, but yeah we uh, got some undercoating put on the bottom all, um, like everything on the underneath unfortunately didn't come painted or anything right did a little touch-up paint on all the d-rings and tie down hooks and that kind of thing that got missed yep and what else did we do we got the winch yeah we installed the winch stoked on the winch and this freaking sweet toolbox yeah craigslist truck bed toolbox is gonna be awesome and we have plans as you saw the inside of the toolbox is like pretty securely mounted not going anywhere we have plans that we want to mount the battery that's going to power the winch yes in there so you to keep everything protected and watertight and safe so hopefully you guys see like a in the near future another episode with this trailer and hopefully we still need to get a spare put on it yeah once i can afford a deep cycle or deep cell battery <laughs> yep a battery a spare <laughs> a spare and that's pretty much this she's ready to rock. I think she's pretty much ready. Maybe we'll uh, probably not be able to afford our next project car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll be all dressed up and nowhere to go. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that was an awesome night. Yes. Congrats. Time Thank for you. a beverage. Later. It has been a blast. We appreciate you watching. Yes, as always. And if you want to support the channel, feel free to give us a subscribe. Right here. And if you want to see more of the project we worked on today, move it over here. And if you want to see any of the other ill-guided automotive antics on the channel, click his gut. Or potentially here. <laughs> right over space. Ah. Thank you guys as always for watching. And we hope to see you in the next one.